This is Professor Darif Seitz. This video calculates a confidence interval for a proportion. The main idea here is to calculate a left endpoint and a right endpoint of a confidence interval for a certain level of confidence for the population proportion. And as a point estimate, we use the sample proportion and a margin of error is calculated. And then the left end point is p hat minus the margin of error and the right end point is p hat plus margin of error. There's three cells of information that you must enter. First, your desired level of confidence, 99% in this case, entered as a decimal. The sample size, which is actually the number of trials, treating this like a, a binomial experiment. So in this example, there's 800 trials. And R represents the number of successful trials out of the 800 trials. In this case, it's 600. Everything else is automatically calculated. P hat, the sample proportion, is V3 over V2. That's R over N, the proportion of successes. Q hat is the complement of P hat. It's 1 minus it. And these next two are needed to verify that we have a situation where we can apply these results, NP hat and NQ hat, both of them must be greater than or equal to 5. And they are here, 600 and 200. Alpha is the complement of the level of confidence called the level of significance. Here we have Z sub C, a critical value. And to get that critical value, we use the normal inverse function, a negation of it to get it on the right side, and then V8, which is the level of significance, divided by 2, which is the area in one tail, and 0 and 1 being the standard normal distribution mean of zero and standard deviation of one. And we're rounding this specifically in this formula here to three decimal places. So we have a critical value, which is in B9. And the margin of error is a formula and it uses the critical value and multiplies by the square root of B4, which is P hat, times B5, which is Q hat, divided by B2, which is N. That's the margin of error. And then the left and right endpoints are simply B4, which is P hat minus E, and P hat plus E. And these, including the margin of error, have been set up, formatted to round to five decimal places in this spreadsheet.